Hey, what's going on guys? It's Bonus XP, and uh, let's play some RuneScape. So I'm just going to sign in for Facebook. And the reason I sign in for Facebook is not because I'm a massive loser and like to post on my Facebook that I'm playing RuneScape. It's just because it saves me typing in my username and password so I can just click it. And it signs me in. I mean, it's so much easier. So if you're doing it, just be careful to untick all the things so it doesn't post. I, I don't know if it will post a status update on your Facebook, but I unticked everything to just make sure it wouldn't, just, <laughs> just in case. So I kind of wanted to do a live stream for bonus XP so I could train and talk to you guys live while I was doing it, but um, I haven't had a chance to try it out the live streaming feature on YouTube, so I'd really I didn't want to try it to do it and then somehow it made a mistake or didn't work very well. And why isn't this logging me in? Let's try again. That's not logging me in. Looks like we're doing it the old-fashioned way. Let's just log in. See what world it takes me to. And I should be at Soul Wars Bank. I think that's where I left it last night. Yeah, here we go. Alright, so... Um, I've got my inventory all set up to start doing Toad Flax straight away. Let me just do my bank pin. Alright, so let's get cracking. And I had a huge fail. Where's my bird nest? I'm just sitting in there. I had a huge, huge fail last night and realised that um, I didn't make my... Most of my pots into it, they're unfinished, so. How do I see my modifier? Toggle XP pop up. Maybe I just hold it over. How do I see my modifier? Well, that's annoying. Alright guys, so I'm just going to use the rest of these pots and <laughs> hopefully try and figure out how to fi find my multiplier and uh, I'll start the video once I've done all these. So just 8 more to go and I'll be finished herb. Let's just make these and check how much I am from a level. 100, 100k. So I probably could have done that if I made, prepared a little earlier. But I'm, I think I'm going to jump right into Slayer right now. Uh, what's my modifier? 2.4. Playing for an hour already? Wow. Alright. Let's go with... Uh, do I already have a Slayer task? Now this is this is my biggest downfall when I'm doing Slayer, because I always take about 20 minutes looking at the bank. I'm just going to get one real quick. My own Lunar? Nope. Alright, let's get a task. Something good. Calf fights. I'm going to skip. I think I'm going to, I need to be really... I mean, I'm going to probably use... I think I'm going to never assign... I'll cancel. Good task. Dark Beasts. Should I do that? I should really just be doing cannon tasks, I think. Because it's double XP. Um, I'm going to skip. I need a cannibal, a good cannibal task. Aberrant Spectres, I'll do that. Uh, rope. Should have probably bought a faster telly. Man, I'm really freaking out about the time I'm wasting. <laughs> I've never been like this before. I really want to get as good um, slayer as I can. I'm pretty sure I should be able to get slayer level today. I um, just check my teleport. Where's the bank? It's up here. Oh, there it is. I um, just about 100k off a of slayer level. I should be able to get that today. So I've pretty much got all today off. Let's get geared up. <clears throat> so, no, no way. Come on. All right, let's get over here. Didn't waste too much time in that one. Could have been worse. All right, so I'll just use this. Gonna use it on Slayer. Here we go. Alright, let's get geared up. Alright, here we go. Ready to go. I forgot how to get there again. What's the fastest teleport? Um, it's the Ring of Slaying. I'll bank my gem. Alright, cool. Alright, so let's rub my Ring of Slaying. Going ahead to... Where's it again? This one. 
Right, let's get my kind of set up. And we're still on a 2.4 multiplier. That's good. Alright, so it's pre mage. And, well, it's been so long since I did this. Oh, pre mage and turmoil, there's one. I've forgotten overloads. <laughs> Such a fail. I believe I forgot overloads. Well, my cannon's gonna do most of the damage anyway, so. No big deal. Oh, dwarf food seed. I'll be picking that one up. And I should be about done now. Kills left. Ten more to go. Oh, it was a dwarf I thought it was a seed. Probably needs to drop this. You know what? I've done this task in <laughs> reasonably good time considering I forgot overloads. Turned out alright. Six more. And 2.2 .2 multiplier. Oh wow, what's that? What is a mithril kite? Oh, this armor looks so weird. I'm still, still not getting used to this armor at all. Don't know about you guys. There we go. Done. I'm just gonna finish this. Pick up the cannon. That's house telly. Should probably just Kurudel tellied actually. Got a straight new task. Let's go charge my prayer. There we go. Come on, something good. Give me something good. A cannibal task. Cannibal task. I straight quorums. These are going to my parent block list. So I've got two spots in my parent block list. You definitely deserve a place. Alright, let's get a new task. Pistol demons. I think I'm going to skip those. You're too slow. Don't even know what those are, so I'm going to skip those. <laughs> Don't have enough time to look up a guide. Should have probably pistol those in my perm block. Gargoyles. Let's skip those. I've got all these points, I may as well use them to get cannonball tasks. Terror dogs, oh come on. Oh Jagex. Trolling me? Pistol demons again? I'm gonna stick these in perm block today. There we go. <laughs> Jagex are really trolling me today, aren't they? Oh damn. That's all. Iron dragons? Screw it, I'll do those. I don't want to go around in circles again. Um, let's place away the bank. Just brush rope again. I'm, I'm, it's been so long since I've been there, I can't think what else I need. I, th I think I'm forgetting something. Bone crusher. There we go, that'll do. Let's get there, that was a, that was a good fast bank. Only an hour and a half. <laughs> Only an hour and a half. I should say wasted, but um, I've got five five hundred k bonus XP. That's pretty good. Most of that, but from here though. All right, so let's. Wow, I expected to see loads of people in here, but I guess not everyone's choosing Slayer. I mean, pretty much anything you do in RuneScape is going to be bo bonus XP. So anything, like any skill you train, it's gonna it's gonna increase it by two. But oh no, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot to take one of those. Oh damn. That's, that's such a silent core thing to do, isn't it? Such a silent core thing to do. And then uh, a real silent core thing to do would be to drink an overload right now. Um, should I just soul split up my health? <laughs> Can't believe I did that. I'm 70k off the level. wonder if I'll get out of this task. Maybe two more tasks. Take a renewal just now. And I want to take an overload, but I'm scared it'll teleport me out. There we go, 700 HP. That should be alright. Oh, come on, soul split. Soul split. Pretty maybe. It's gonna keep me in. Thank god. No! Is it teleport? Oh, I thought it was teleporting me out there. 
I think that you're you're good at ring teleport shot if you have less than ten percent health XP. It's done that to me so many times. All right, so I'm just gonna <laughs> try not to die. Um, I keep thinking I'm forgetting so I'm forgetting something. My aura, my aura is on. Well, it should be good. May as well pick up the charms. So uh, some some cool things you can do in double XP weekend. Um, um, I've got quite a few tips. So if you want to train farming, the best thing to do would have been um, I probably should have said this yesterday, but would be to to have all your trees planted and uh, all ready to be checked. So by the time you log on in bonus XP, as soon as you log in, you can just do that farm run. And obviously you won't be doing a normal farm run, so you won't be checking them and then replanting them. You'll just be going around and checking them all. And then because I mean you don't want to waste the time of planting them, you just want to check them all as quick as you can and then go on to another skill. So you just, you'll just wait till after bonus XP to, to replant them. So another cool thing you can do during bonus XP is if you want to train dungeoneering, I really, I mean, if you've got the money, you might as well just buy a dungeoneering floor and then um, I'd really recommend doing it with either friends or people you know well because it really is quite easy to get scammed. I mean, there's, if you're paying for a floor, they're more than likely going to ask for the money up front. And then, I mean, who's saying they won't just log out on you? Um, but especially on double XP, what you can do is, uh, if, you, if you're leeching a floor, you can log out. And you'll still remain in that dungeon. And uh, they might need you to log back in if they're doing the emotes room or the levers room. Uh, so you can just log in, do that, and then just log back in just before they, they finish the dungeon. So you can get your XP, and you're going to be getting your XP for all the dungeons and still having a really high multiplier. Because if you think about it, if you're going to be sitting there the whole dungeon, especially if it's a large, I mean, that's sometimes between 20 to 30 minutes, you're just going to be sitting there wasting your multiplier. But I mean, I think the best skills to do are ones that are going to be, that are going to cost money, because as I said earlier, just anything you're going to do is, is it's going to save you half the time. So you might as well do something that's going to, that, that, that costs money, so then you're not only halving your time, but you're saving yourself some money as well. Such a charm whore, I know, but I want to make sure I get 99 summoning <laughs> before I get 99 slayer. So I don't want to have to camp water fiends or anything. Right, I've just finished this task. I, I forgot my gems, so I, it was a bit of a surprise of me finishing the task. I was wondering why I was just standing there not attacking anything. So let's go get a new one. Hoping for something good. So I got a, an effigy that task, and uh, yeah, that's about it. <laughs> let's see what I get. Steel Dragons! I think I'll probably need to bank. Yeah, I'll need to bank. Alright, uh, I'm going to start bringing house tabs. I think it'll be a lot quicker to bank. Change prey, just go birth rope for now. Alright, so let's try and keep this 2.1 multiplier. I'm going to... Usually when I do this third task, I, after a task I just bank all. I'm going to try and see how much of this I can actually keep in here. I've got the charms down here, stackables down here. So about the sapphire, the limbs, bone. <laughs> and I'm gonna grab some more. Where's my supplies? There they are. A couple of those. A couple of those. Gonna bank that. Take four of those of spur. And some. I, think I might need more prayer pots than that. Good chance I won't have enough prayer pots. But screw it, I'm gonna go I'm gonna go for it. <laughs> Call me crazy. Right, let's go. That was that was probably the quickest bank I've ever done ever. Resistance dragon fire is done, so I'm gonna drink it before I go through this time. Mini turmoil. I'm kind of scared I won't be left with enough health. Might need to soul split a little bit. Once this iron gets off me, was that a prayer pot? Free prayer pot. I'm taking this. I'm taking that. All right. I'm gonna soul split some health up. If I may, there we go. 
as overload for renew. Right, so when I first started the um like right before double XP activated, I think it activated at about um exactly midday on Friday, which is today. <laughs> and uh I, I was sitting there making unfinished pots waiting for the system update and I was wondering why there was no update and then I realised I had this little plus here. <laughs> so I was actually just wasting I, I think I wasted about twenty minutes of my my multiplier when I first started because I was just making those unfinished pots. So um I mean how many fails have I done this bonus XP weekend? It's been quite crazy. So I'm going to stop recording and finish this task. I'm just about halfway through the last ever episode of The Walking Dead. Uh, well, not last ever episode, but the last episode of this series. So, um, yeah, I'm going to gonna watch that while I do this task, and I'll start recording once I've done. Okay. Oh my god, how lucky is this? I just finished the task, and I've got two prayer points left. I'm lucky they've stopped attacking me, so I'm just going to grab my stuff and run. And uh, I, was, I was actually so totally amazed at that. Walking Dead episode, I <laughs> I forgot to look back at my screen and my I think my um super anti fire run out, so I died. Well I didn't die but my, my ring teleported me outside and I had to go get a new ring. So I had to kinda of bank. But let's see what I got next. I I don't really mind doing the dragon task because um you get the bones. It helps me with prayer, especially with bonus XP, and I'm definitely not doing that. Oops. Didn't cancel that one. I'm gonna have no point slash after this weekend, am I? <laughs> dust Devils. Yeah, I'm gonna skip that one. There are Dust Devils. I'm gonna skip it actually. I, I really want some good cannon ones. I just want constant dragoness the whole the whole weekend. Iron Dragons. I don't feel like doing those again. Even though I just said I don't mind doing dragons, I, I don't want to do them again. <laughs> Oh, come on! I'm still getting trolled this weekend. Come on. Are you serious? I need like 10 block spots, so I just block everything but Dagonus. <laughs> right, I'm gonna do those levels because uh, this is just gonna go around in circles. I'm gonna use my tab actually. So, um, oh, one K off a Slayer level. Oh boy. Oh boy. This is gonna be the task. Right, so I'm gonna charge my prayer and then use my mounted glory. I love the house. It's, it's, it's the best, the best for, the best for everything. We'll Slayer. Let's use my mounted glory. And there we go. So let's go Edgeville. And I'm gonna, I think I have a combat familiar. I'm gonna, like, I've never used a combat familiar for a task before, but I'm gonna give one a try. I don't really feel like using a bunyip. Alright, let's see if I can bank quick. And I'm just gonna bank all, actually. The one thing I'm really scared of is, um, the, <laughs> the kind of new peak airs you see that use the, so the storm of something. Must be a different spell, but the storm of, that storm spell. Because they're on the normal magic boot, they can teleport you and then use that spell, and I mean, that is. It's pretty insane. Right, I've played three hours already. Three hours straight to RuneScape. We're doing a big today, guys. I heard that the, the, the mummy spots in um, the Apatol tunnel, there's about three people in every world, which is insane. Really insane. Wow, it's three, three people here. And I'm gonna get out of here before I die. And that was my phone. Yeah, people should know when I'm playing RuneScape, I don't. I'm not gonna text you back. Oh. And we found the Dust Devils. I was just kidding, by the way, about that not texting back thing. What well, kind of. Alright, guys, I've just finished this task. I'm gonna go straight ahead and get a new one. That was. that was quite long. I'm I'm kind of feeling that I'm going cross-eyed. I think I've played, let's say I'm, I've played for four hours straight today. I, so I think I'm going to make this, um, I'll see what I get next. Career Demons. I don't feel like doing those. I think it would take too long to get equipped and things for the wildy one. Oh, Dagoneth! Perfect! Absolutely perfect. Alright, so I'm going to straight away, I'm just going to teleport to 
my house and recharge my prayer and get set up. Um, I, I think that's I think that's enough RuneScape for today. I think I'm going to take a break and then I'm going to edit this video and hopefully have it up today, which is Friday. And um, I think I've got a video going up in Machinima Realm today and uh, yeah, an exam. So I'm not, I'm not sure whether it'll, it'll be up before I put this video up or after. But um, so this could, I mean, it's going to be three videos today or should be. So um, I hope you guys have enjoyed them. Uh, if any of you have watched this right to the end, I know it's been quite a long video. Um, but do let me know if you'd like me to make another one tomorrow, because I'll probably be doing some Slayer tomorrow, and um, maybe Sunday as well. And I think maybe does XP run on right to Monday? Maybe if I get up really early on Monday, I could use some. Or um, I don't think I care that much. Uh, let's just get this done. Lantern as well. I'm trying to do this quite quick, because I'm wasting quite a lot of time. Should be an option to skip randoms, to be honest, or have them blocked. I mean, I know they're to stop bots, but... <laughs> bots that work in RuneScape usually always have the randoms done anyway, so... They're not really helping. I mean, I mean that, was, that was the reason randoms were added in the first place, right? To stop bots, and... Uh, all bots have random detection in, or random coding or whatever. Because, I mean, there's only a select few randoms, it's not like they don't, like, change a lot. So, yeah, we should be able to skip them. Or maybe if you're, I don't know, maybe there should be some requirement, maybe you have to do something to be able to skip them, a task for each one or something like that. Uh, let's go to Edgeville. So I'm just going to get geared up and then log out, so as soon as I come on tomorrow I'm going to be geared up and ready to go. Whoops, I didn't mean to drink that. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.